Windshuttle Foundation can be leveraged to address most of your master data needs. One of our biggest use cases is material creation, which can often be quite complex and lengthy. Here from our form library, I'll choose the material creation process. In our example here, the, the initiator or person who starts the process fills in basic data. They can do that either by just filling it in from the basic form here, an empty form, or we can use a reference or copy from material. If we know the material number in plant, we can retrieve the data, but if we're not sure, we can search. Now the search here in this case is in order to find a reference material, but you can also search to see if there are any materials that are already out there, then this would be a duplicate. So I've got a material range, I've got material types like finished goods and semi-finished goods, and then I can use a wild card here for description. It's going to find any materials in the SAP system that currently match the search criteria. And you'll see here we have a list. I'll choose my reference or copy from material. And then I can choose the plant and read that data. And it's going to populate this particular view, but it will also populate other views as you'll see in a little while. Now in this particular example, we have to fill in a material number. Your process may generate one for you. And we can go through and update. So this description will be updated because we're going to have a 128 gigabyte phone. We can also provide drop downs and we can provide ways to look that up. Here is what we call an F4 lookup where it pops up in a window what's currently loaded into SAP for this selection. And we'll choose uh, retail for the industry sector.